Okay, so today we're going to ask a question and we are going to ask this question that I'm thinking about in my head. We are going to ask why the 90s Happy Hakoi is so different to the trade tense and today. I think this one is going to be so in really interesting for me to talk because I do not talk about this topic at all. It's not my thing. It's the first time I'm doing, Bob. Hey, I want to have an excitement for everybody and also the audience for you guys, everything. So we are going to ask the question. So the reason why 90s Happy Hardcore is so different to the Trey Tense Happy Hardcore and today, because the 90s Happy Hardcore, the beat in the, the music was like club, house, deep house, you will dance, you will pop. And yet the Trey Tense and today, it has a hard style influence in day. Because hard style, the genre came out in the trade tense after EDM. I think it came out to 2013, I don't know. But it came out around that time. It's just kind of so different because the 90s, I saw Happy Hardcore with drum and bass beat, like your dance beat, your pop beat, deep house beat. It's just kind of very insane to think about like a song like example, like Dune, Can't Stop Raving, or like the others, or like um, it's kind of very different. And today, like S3 L L, like something like I don't know, like this one right here. It's just kind of very different. I think for me, my opinion, I love the nineties happy hardcore yacht. I think I'm the gear yacht. The trade tense is so cool. And right now, the person who's bringing back the happy hardcore genre, it seems, is Nano Beat. I really love this guy. I love his recent songs like Dream Utopia, like Wagen, Raver. Tonight, Moonlight, To You, all those songs are so good. I think they were my favorite. And also the other recent one right here. I think this guy right now, he's bringing back the 90s Happy Hakoi. I already see he started to do that. I'm so happy everything started to come back 2020 because the year 10, 2016, 2019 was not so much like that because at that time there was no Noji Star. Because Noji Star was over in 2015, 2014. After that, 2016, 2019, we don't have any more about that. Because we start to see Mambo Rap, Tropical House, Future Bass, Mubenton, Yanti Pop, Future House. They all start to become so popular in the mainstream. And hip hop also become popular in the mainstream. Rick Boss Mayons. That's why it is so very crazy that time. And now the Noji Star start to come back because of the 30 years full cycle of Noji Star. It's the same thing that I'm talking about in my last video of Rudy Good Arrow, of the Coca-Cola No Drink. The Y3000. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let me know in the comments if you agree on this opinion or not at all. Anyway, see you later. Bye.